Hey guys, this is Chris with Day Action. Uh, today I'm doing a follow-up video on my first two videos of how not to buy a money pit. Uh, today I have a first-time home buyer. He put in an offer on this house. I think it may have happened a little too quickly. I didn't really ask him if he could find, uh, if he could afford all the problems that we found. Uh, that's not really my job. My job was just to come out and find everything. So I'm going to show you just some five basic problems that I can see just by looking around in two minutes. So one of the first obvious problems that I found was in this closet here. Uh, you can see that there's mold at the bottom of the closet. And then I just kind of walked over and looked at the water heater. And you can see uh, that there is some corrosion at the shutoff valve here. And uh, there's an obvious water leak. Problem number two, I noticed at the top here that the uh, siding is starting to pull away. And then if you look down the side of the brick right here, you can see obvious signs of deflection cracks. All right, so for problem number three, I noticed that there's some water leaking out the exterior wall here, and it's obviously coming from some indoor plumbing. This is not supposed to happen. Last problem, I noticed that the roof uh, is starting to show some really big signs of aging. There's a lot of granule loss. It's real shimmery, and the shingles are starting to buckle. All right, everyone, I found all of those problems in five minutes. Uh, all I did was walk around the exterior once, walk around the interior once, opened up all the closets, and just see if anything stuck out to me. I know I have more of a trained eye than most, but if it looks funny to you when you're walking around, what do you think it looks like to your professional home inspector? Um, that's, that's it. Uh, that's just reinforcing the first two videos. If you have any home inspection questions, please give me a call, and then please like and share the videos. That is the best way I can get out there and educate the public, and uh, leave a comment or join the YouTube channel. Man, I am going on forever.